Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and also welcome back to my fall favorite series. Today I'll be making oatmeal bars made from pears. So stick around to see how these come okay, out. Okay, so I'm going to begin by pureeing two of my pears. So I'm just going to add them to my ninja and you can peel them or um, if you choose not to, that's fine too. And then I'm just going to blend this until I end up with my puree. Okay, that looks pretty good. And I'll continue by adding half cup of applesauce, half cup of almond butter, and two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Just blend that in together. There it is. And I'm just going to transfer this to my mixer. And I'm going to continue by adding two teaspoons of cinnamon, one teaspoon of ground ginger, half teaspoon of ground cloves, half teaspoon of salt, three quarter, three quarter cups of oat flour, half cup of rolled rolled oats <laughs> and three quarter teaspoons of baking powder. Mix that all in. Okay, so in my blender, I'm going to add my peeled pears. And this time, instead of pureeing them, I'm just going to dice them. Okay, and then I'm just going to add them to my batter. I love pears. Pears are definitely a fall fruit. I feel like I, I buy them more during the fall and also I see them more. But I'm really excited about these bars. I've been wanting to make them for a while. And they're very fall with all the spices that I added, the clove, the cinnamon. I'm really excited. Okay, so there's my batter. Okay, so I don't have a square mold. So I'm going to be using my... So I'll be using this one, but it should be fine. I'm still going to cut them once they're done. So I'm just going to add my batter to my mold. Spread it out evenly. Wow, this smells so good. I smell the, I can smell the cinnamon from up here. Okay, so I'm gonna bake these at 350 degrees for 30 minutes. Okay. Ooh, that smells so good. There it is, and I'm just gonna let it cool before I cut into it but it looks delicious and it smells really good too. Okay, so here are my bars. I, as you can see, I did cut them in little squares. So let's give one a taste. Mm, wow, mm, they are so good. They're so moist too. I don't know if you can see the bottom. But wow, mm. Like I said, I love pears and I've never baked with them before, but this is delicious. Highly recommended. Everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And like always, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Until next time.